Yeah. What's up, y'all? Music Idiot is back with another episode. We've been gone for two days. But as usual, we got the core members. We got Nazir. What's up, guys? Nazir here. How y'all doing? This nigga sucks dick for a living. I'm, <laughs> I'm playing. Um, then we got Kitsune. I don't know if he has an opening soundboard. But yeah, um, welcome back. Welcome back to Music Idiots. Um, how's the last two days been that we haven't been filming for y'all? How y'all feel about that? I mean, I mean, we never we have a little break eventually. For sure, for sure. It's, it's been all right. Yeah, it's been all right. But also, we have important news for you at the end of the podcast regarding the future of Music Idiots as a whole, and regarding something that I'm gonna be doing, which is starting my solo podcast. But we'll talk about that at the end, or maybe another video. We'll see how we'll see where the road takes us. So, last night, a Travis Scott show that I was supposed to go to. Kanye West showed up. He showed up. Kanye, crazy, and Ty Dolla Sign, and Bump J. Let's not forget about Bump J. But he doesn't really matter. <laughs> um, Kanye and Ty showed up and performed at the Circus Maximus show last night. Keep in mind, I was supposed to go there. Very upset about it. Matter of fact, Nazir, tell him how upset I was that angle. My 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 man was winning the call right, and he found out from Instagram obviously that Kanye and Ty they were, they showed up with the the, Mac, the concert. My man, he was going, say, bro, what the heck, man? I should have went. Like, he was going a huge over, like, ramp. I was insane. Yeah, I was like, damn, bro. I could have been there. I mean, I'm going to try to go to the Drake and J. Cole. Big as the what? Tour. So, I'm going to try. But, um, but, yeah, Kanye showed up. And from what it seems like, he's doubling down on this release date of February 9th for Vultures Volume 1. Oh, and we've got to tell y'all, there's also a new track list. A whole new track list that he dropped. Well, not that. Well, not necessarily he dropped, but it's on. It was on um his daughter's shirt at the track list. But um, basically, what happened was Kanye performed a bunch of fucking classics, and he said these exact words: "New album called Vultures, February 9th. He is doubling down on this release date. But yeah, but bro, you should have heard me and Nazir's reaction uh, for people listening on. You should have heard me and Nazir's reaction. We heard that one note from Runaway. It was was insane. Yeah. Absolutely insane. So yeah, he performed Runaway, the song Vultures. I feel the fade. Did that one too. He did Can't Tell Me Nothing, All the Lights, and Father Stretch My Hands Part 1. So that's a pretty good set list. But you can ask this here. I was actually asking for everybody to be performed off the album. Yes. Yeah, he wanted everybody at uh, the, the Vultures album. But, uh, but I, everybody. That would been kind of cool that he did that. Yeah, no, but that Aaron Moshkin did that bitch at a Travis concert. See this year. In my heart, it but also, if you guys want to know where we've been for the past two days, we've been chilling. You know, we've been taking our time off, and we've been listening to new albums and new shit that I show these two, you know, to prepare for another episode. And yeah, and here we are. Yeah, for real. So yeah. Oh, expect the Man on the Moon theory review. That is going to come out, and I'm going to talk about Nazir crying into the void, but we're not going to talk about that for now. Not to- <laughs> He's like, yeah. <laughs> Anyways, let's move on. Yeah, had a very emotional moment. i never seen a thug cry until Nazir started crying. <laughs> oh, stop. My no exception, I have an excuse. It was late at night, and I was a little tired. The tears kind of came out. I have, I have an excuse, but I still cried, though. <laughs> I have an excuse. Yeah. But I still cried, but anyways. Yeah, but um, some new updates to the track list. Uh, Lil Baby got taken off everybody. 
That's insane. That's kind of like, what the hell? A lot of people actually hit on his verse, but I think one of the few people that, well, including us. Actually, like. Yeah. Like, we all actually fucked with Lil Baby's verse as an outro, but it is what it is. We still get Charlie Wilson singing the hook to everybody. We still get one in the pink, one in the stink. You know what I mean? We still get our iconic lines. But, um, yeah. And, obviously, we all know this. Um, Nicki Minaj got taken off a new body because she wants to be a little bitch. How you feel about that? <laughs> Imagine that's crazy. No, couldn't be me. Like, like, no, and the worst part is, though, like, We'll talk about this in another podcast, but Megan Thee Stallion and Nicki are beefing, and Nicki is losing. If y'all thought Kanye's crash outs were bad, oh my god, Nicki Minaj is on a whole nother level of crashing out. Yeah, yeah, but that's another topic for another day. Topic. But, yeah, but new body, new body got taken off. El Bozo, El Nicki. Um. But we got everybody back to me. Fuck some time moving slow. Beg forgiveness, and we actually get um do it with YG. Probably one of the Zier's favorite songs of Vultures. Tell me how you feel about it. Yes, <laughs> it's about to go down. Fuck, it's crazy for real. I'm, I'm hyped oh for God, that, bro. And, and then we got I'm just here to get paid with Future. So we got Tipo Freestyle. We got Slide with James Blake being added to the track. James Blake, that, 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 that's, surpri- that's surprising. But I feel like James Blake, he hasn't disappointed me so far in his discography. So I think like, he's really good. Yeah. Good. And then we got Promotion with Future again. We got obviously Vultures with Dirk and Bump. Then we got a song that we never heard before. Love, 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 love. <laughs> so I think I said it four times, but it's three times. <laughs> but um, <laughs> I'm a little dyslexic, but it's all right. <laughs> I can't read, but you know we're chilling. Oh, uh, we got Tony with um Northwest. She made it on the album. Then we got a song called Hood Rat. I I don't know. I don't know what it is. Then we got River with Young Thug and Leon Bridges. Take me to your river. Some of the best songs that we've heard on Vultures. We got Gun to My Head, a song called Take Off Your Dress. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. A man who listens to River and like gun to my head, these sad ass songs. Where you just take off your dress now. Uh. <laughs> uh, that, 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 that that's gonna be interesting. Yeah, and then we get the final track. Fire on the IG mode, I get through, I'm picking that out. Thank you. Finish it off. Oh my god, <laughs> bro! Wait, oh wait. my god, nah, come on, dude, come on! You be saying it every time you play Overwatch. Come on, bro! Fuck on the IG mode, I get them kicking it out. She did, she, she did. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, and yeah, yeah. So and if you want to know what the final track is called, you just call it "Dead" <laughs> with Future and Lil Durk. So that track's clearly been stuck in his ear set for the past couple of days. But yeah, man, and you know, let me just say this overall, we're all hyped for both just to come out. We're all ready for it to drop February 9th, bro. Let's fucking do it. I'm fucking ready. Nazir, how ready are you for it? Yes, bro. It's been way too long for this freaking delayed album. Finally, we get to hear a track of this from Vulture's album, Volume 1. I am so, so hyped for this. Yeah, and if you stick into the February 9th release date, that means we're getting. Volume two on March eighth, and volume three on April fifth. Which is not bad date. Not not bad dates. Not bad at all. Yeah, and for all the people complaining about Ty Dolla Sign and Ye having three albums, shut the hell up. Stop complaining. This is the closest to the kind really? of music we're getting, bro. So you can either stick with it. So we could complain like a little bitch. <laughs> uh huh. For real. For real. Many. But yeah. Sorry for vultures. I'm excited, man. Finally, something. It's something inside And um for season two, we're gonna actually yeah, we're gonna be filming a first reaction to Vultures as well. We're gonna do we and we're gonna react to all three volumes. Yes, we are. We are gonna react to all three volumes for Vultures. That's a, a must. But we, we got to do it. We got to do it. We gotta do it, baby. Do it. <laughs> baby, do it. <laughs> yeah. Time on this loud. Oh, it's loud. <laughs> Wait, what? It's so late. 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 It
Get some of these back hey. from the podcast, y'all. Hey. Our main member almost left. Get some of that. Wait, put the hello. Come on, put your intro in. <laughs> you didn't ever put hello. your intro in. Hello. <laughs> y'all only gonna put it. Oh, man. No, it, I- it, 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 it's, it's all good, sir. It's all good, man. It's all good. It's all good. <laughs> You know what? I'll do the intro for him. I got you. I got you. Me out, nigga. <laughs> hey, yo, what the heck? Uh, uh, all right, then. Uh, YouTube. <laughs> Come on, bro. When you ever got to pump gas in your car, oh pump in your booty with maximum kinetic energy with us. Okay. I want this nigga hung by jumper cables. <laughs> I'm sorry. I had to. Anyways, anyways. The soon as a month, I'm stop. <laughs> well, you better chill with it. You're going to mute me and call you out. <laughs> you better cook you first. You're the one that called him stop. I'm sure you're right. Never mind. <laughs> well, well, I mentioned it, though. I think I remember that. No. Because, I, because I'm going to hang my head in shame. <laughs> I'm stop. But, uh, anyways. <laughs> Nigga. <laughs> my bad, my bad. <laughs> Oh. Oh. <laughs> Alright, niggas. Mm-hmm. Oh, that's what I'm gonna do to get Oh. Move on, come on. We're, we're here for like 10 minutes already. Come on, niggas. <laughs> Stop. Stop. <laughs> Arden, this is a fat ass bitch. <laughs> <laughs> What, what, wait, man, what, what you mean? You forgot about Mac, too. You forgot about her. <laughs> All right. Hey, bitch, just because you fat as fuck don't mean the thighs are Mac. <laughs> Spend as many booty pics as you want, and jeans ain't gonna fool me, nigga. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. Anyways, move on. Move on, move on. Move on. All right, all right, all right. But, yeah. <laughs> oh. All right, nigga. Uh-huh. <laughs> All right, it's next podcast, it. nigga. It's <laughs> today. I'm about to go. Oh, yeah. 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 Hi, I'm one time. SpongeBob. I'm SpongeBob. I'm about to go. <laughs> Hey man, my reaction is. <laughs> hey yo, what? That is serious. You know what? Nazir, that's it. You're getting back shots. What you doing, son? No, no, not again. No. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. All right, all right, move on, move on. Okay, right, actually, move. We're done. Oh my God. Stop! 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 Back your ass is overrated, nigga! <laughs> Stop! You're making me laugh! Stop! Okay. Yo, you know what, watch this, ready? Hey, oh my god, you built like a pair of niggas, goddamn. Donna Tell over the Chicago's Bill Air. Motherfucking, hey guys, how you doing, Bill? Motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> be kidding. That nigga be kissing his mom on the lips. Making out and shit. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, get soon they called the alright, this you getting back shots. <laughs> it. Oh he was <laughs> oh, I go back. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways guys. Anyway, oh shit! <laughs> My back! No. My back! <laughs> okay. Okay. Man, fuck this podcast is the worst episode ever. <laughs> I can't believe it. Oh, my back! Oh, my back. <laughs> oh, my back. <laughs> <laughs>
Stop, 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 right. stop laughing at me, stop! Oh. Okay. Okay. I okay. still feel more laughing, little nigga. I'm about to put you back in the basement. What the hell? <laughs> anyway. Uh, All right, sorry. Uh, <clears throat> we, uh, we had a little, we, we had a little chuckle, a little guffaw, if you will. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> a little guffaw. Alright, 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 Height for vultures. Mm-hmm. <laughs> it's not funny. It's not. It's I can't not. help it. <laughs> all right, all right, all right, all right. Yes, we all hyper vultures. Yeah, we're all we're all hyper vultures. Right. With his load. My bad. <laughs> all right, move on. Move on to um, <laughs> music news. More some new new music news. Don't right, tell yes. man. The homeboy. All right, all right, all right. So, this say Don Tolliver. We're saying for the end of the podcast. You fucking t- bro. I'm laughing. Shut up. I forgot what to say. <laughs> hey man, he did it. <laughs> oh, Anyways, all right. all right. So yeah, that's my. Uh, he bought a job. Vultures. We all hype for it. Expect a podcast of us reacting to it. Um, yeah, so the next thing we report on, um, Top Dog Entertainment is actually making a comeback. Uh, Schoolboy Q's dropping an album March 1st. It's been years. It's been years. Yeah, that's crazy. Yeah, it's been five, you can't be I think it's been five years since Schoolboy Q's last album. That, that, that uh, that's insane thing, it's actually insane. I thought like Turtle just opening her mouth. Bitch, are you good? You know, here, just keep talking about schoolwork. You're going to feed this little fucking person. But yeah, schoolboy's coming out with the album. What, March, she said? March, what, 9th? 8th? It's 9th, right? Yeah. You, you know, schoolboy, man, that's the homeboy. You know what I'm saying? Like, schoolboy is the man. So, him dropping an album in March, that's been kind of hype. You know, Jules, he told me, how, like, he's listening to schoolboy and Ken's writing the, 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 the color green. Color Green, so that that song, you need a bunch of songs on that album. Oh, that song it was really good. But yeah, Schoolboy, school he was dropping an album. It's I am pressure. actually ready for this. Where's your turn? Bitch, don't look at me like that. Did you shit in the corner of your? Bitch, is that food? Did you? Good and damn well, you did not just waste a bunch of food. You're a spoiled ass turtle. I'm about to eat you later. Huh? I'm back. What's good, y'all? Man, uh, I, I was telling about I'm hyper school, um, schoolboy Q's album. Yeah, but um, yeah, the schoolboy Q last album he dropped was called Crash Talk. Now, it might not have been his best album, but it has some pretty good tracks, you know, Num Num Juice. Then we have Chopsticks from Travis Scott. Hot take, I actually think Chopsticks is actually a pretty good song. I just feel like Travis Scott should have had a verse on Chopsticks. Um, oh, yeah, for sure, without a doubt. Uh, oh, yeah, let's not forget about Schoolboy Q's song kind of was that part. Oh, okay, 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 okay. You know what I mean? Yeah, I do know that. Yeah. I feel like going. That's just right. So let's not forget about that part. And you know, 
Collard Greens, Man of the Year, Often with the Weekend, like so many good songs for what you can all live. And if y'all don't know, Top Dog Entertainment <clears throat> could have been one of the best labels ever, but they've been very inconsistent with their artists. Um, mm -hmm. Yeah, and but to see that they're finally starting this run of dropping albums again, even though Kendrick Lamar is not there, <laughs> I guess that Kendrick Lamar check right now. <laughs> But it's still pretty cool, though. I yeah. Doing all this. Yeah, and also, I sent them the VC chat if you want to look during the thing. Uh, that's crazy. Yeah, so, so, yeah, for real. yeah so we got Schoolboy Q dropping Blue Lips. Then we got Sir, J Rock, Dochi, Ray Vaughn, Zakari, Sizzlers dropping Lana, uh, Absol, Isaiah Rashad, Cal Banks, Devin Malik, Lance Skywalker. And then apparently, they're teasing three more new artists that they're signing. That's a lot of artists. And then finally, we're going to be getting a Top Dog Entertainment compilation album. Which is kind of hype. I'm, yeah. I'm, I'm, I'm excited for this. Did you hear SZA and fucking Schoolboy Q on a couple of tracks? Didn't hear fucking, you know, uh, Zakari. I remember, I remember Zakari, he was on Love. Love me. That shit was fun. The song. Yeah. Yeah, that's probably Zakari's most known song. But aside from that, he's actually pretty good. Is my shirt? Did you get stuck, bitch? Did you get stuck under the rock again? Oh my god, you did, guys! If you hear banging in the background, my turtle's being a little bit uh, special. Yeah, yes, yeah, being a little special. Anyways, um, <clears throat> so yeah. So Top Dog Entertainment is dropping, and we're still with Schoolboy Q. I can't wait to see what kind of run they go on. Oh, and actually, you know what? Just because, after um, we're done with this episode, we're going to be listening to, top, to some Top Dog shit from them. I'll be showing. And no, it's not a bad thing, because this thing, some of their careers actually just started. They're relatively new. Mm -hmm. But, like, you got people that were around a little while, like Schoolboy Q, J-Rock, Absol. You know, that type of shit. But then you got, you know, a couple of newer people in the polls. My one issue with Top Dog is that they wait too, too many years for artists to drop again. So let's hope that 2024, that they're consistent, that we get a new Top Dog album on average every, like, month or two months, you know? Let's hope. <clears throat> yeah, let's hope they don't hold back SZA again for another five years, because that did happen. That's why SZA didn't drop for five years, because Top Dog Entertainment didn't let her. But yeah. Kind of stupid. Yeah, they were waiting for that Kendrick Lamar check to come in one last time. <laughs> Literally. But yeah, um, speaking of Kendrick leaving TDE, it's kind of a big loss because, like, I'm not going to lie, Kendrick was a dope-ass member of TDE when he was there. Like... He was, man. Like, Kendrick, bro, I know you're not in Top of the I know you're working with Baby Keem and doing your Top of the Morning, Top of the Morning. <laughs> I know you're I know you're being goofy as hell with Baby Keem right now, but bro, please still collab on the TDE compilation album at least. Or be on some of the albums type shit. Cause you're cause those collabs were hidden, bro. Anyways, um Yeah, man, and that's pretty much look for Tyler Entertainment. We're already 23 minutes into the podcast. Low key, this might be our shortest one, but hey, that's that's kind of a way to end off with a bang, I guess. But um Yeah. Yeah, man, and, you know, we're just going to be just absolutely just hype. 2024 is already looking like a good start for the year. I mean, we had, we literally had Kid Cudi, 21 Savage. Lyrical Lemonade's album was not bad at all. Yeah. It, it, it was that, 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 that album actually surprised me, that album. actually surprised me. Oh, for sure, yeah. Now, don't get me wrong, Lyrical Lemonade's not on the same, he's not on the same level as, like, Metro Boomin. Oh no, but but he still has his own level. Yeah, yeah, he has his own level. Like, he probably like, probably got a bunch of 2018, 2019 rappers. They haven't heard of him. Yeah, too. Uh, but but like Lil Skies, my guy, Lil Skies, man, I've been doing a minute. So, yeah, Lil Skies. Skies and Lil Tech on the same song, and that dude was hidden. Yeah, so that, that was kind of cool. Like them two were like, collab on a, on a song. Also never, that was kind of cool. Also never knew Sheck West, Skin and Slum God, and JID would work on a track. But here we yeah. Go. Uh, which, it worked. It actually worked. Yeah, but um, as I was saying, you know, um, 
And now on to the next part of this podcast. Um, I put these niggas on to Monster by Future. And I think I'm going to let Nazir give his review first. You, you, you got me first. Man. Yeah, your top six songs. Um, what would you rate the album out of 10? Just go ahead. Dude. All right, now listen. Listen, listen. I know, I know, Future fans. I, I know it's been kind of a late. I know we've been a late album come out like years ago. But listen, I like my future, but I never completed this album, Monster. Now, Monster, in my opinion, probably one of the best albums. In, probably one of the best, best albums as an artist, in my opinion, one of the best albums. You know what I'm saying? So, my top six songs, obviously number one. Um, yeah, yeah, ask me throw away. That song was. Head and throw away, right? My, my number two best song, Codeine Crazy. You already know. Uh, my third best song, I like Monster. Monster was pretty good. Um, uh, my fourth best song was Radical. Was really the first first song of the album. It was kind of cool. My fifth best song was Game Life. Which was hitting. My sixth best song is on Fetty. I really like Fetty a lot. Now, what rate this album? Honestly. I'll give it like a nine. I'll give it like a ten out of ten. I, every song was not much of a, a, a hit or a miss at all. None of these songs. I give it ten. I give it a ten out of ten for real. Yeah, that's my review on Future, a Monster. All right, um, I'll be back. Uh, just keep them entertained. I don't know, suck some dick, make it controversial. Oh. What? My- I just okay. But yeah, Future, Future's album was pretty good. Kasuni, what do you think of album? Reason to Monster. What do you think of it, Kasuni? You liked it? You hate it? What, what, what do you think, Kasuni? You liked it? That one's kind of fire, man. Now listen, if I were to tell you to review the album, like one out, like, like one out of ten, what, what would you rate the album from a scale of one to ten? I'll, I'll give it a ten. The album actually, I am really good at the album. Actually, I had a good song with that album. Like every song was not a hit or miss at all whatsoever. You give it a 10? You say give it a 10, guys. That was a pretty good album. Okay, I'm back. It, it's, it, that's cool. You're back? I right, what's up. I, I literally get Kasuna is bringing the album. You say give it a 10 out of 10 for Monster. Damn. You liked it. Damn. All right, Kasuna. I see you. I see you. Being my favorite little nigga yeah. out there. I'm sorry. All right, so. But yeah, I. I I give my review of the song that I like. I, I give him the rundown. Right. down. So, so now it's my turn. Yes, it's your turn. All right. See, you already know how I review albums. I'm going to go a lot more in depth. A lot more. Well, not be with it. But um, first off, I agree with the rank. Monster is one of Future's best mixtape slash albums. Um, it is definitely, it is, I don't care what anyone says, it is up there with DS2. Is definitely up there with, with, with 56 Nights. It's up there with I Never Liked You, Kyle Life. Like, Future, to be honest, Future's had a great discography. Mm-hmm. The only album I didn't really like was the Future and Juice World joint. Yeah, that, that one wasn't like, it was, I mean, yeah, I get it. It wasn't that, it's kind of like, it was okay, that's kind of like, but it definitely was okay. not the best. In terms of future, it's just, it most of like a Juice War album with future features on it. Yeah. And you know, then obviously, then obviously we got the Wizard, which I definitely gotta get y'all into the Wizard. You got Save Me, High Off Life. You know, just, just Future's run has been really great. And let's not forget his all his features on Metro Boomin's album. <laughs> Turn into yes. a super My man, so many. Hero. Yes. And to be honest, yeah, I'm just put a quick little thing out there before I get to my real monster. Um, Metro Future, we're waiting on that album. We're waiting on that album. Wait, wait, t- t- talk real quick. Yeah. Oh no, my. Oh, I thought you, you echo for a second. Then you stopped. Oh, you good though. Thank you're good. the Lord, because I'm not trying to end this episode this early. <laughs> but um. Yeah. But yeah, so my real on Future's album, Monster. I gave it a 10. And my favorite songs, my favorite song is Cody and Crazy, actually. Who's something like, who, like, who doesn't like Cody and Crazy? That shit was hard. Um, my second favorite song is actually the first song, Radical. My third favorite song is Throwaway. Throwaway okay. is so amazing because, like, the way he, like, 
Because, like, it's a very interesting story as well about the mentality of future. You feel me? Like, he's out here, like, loving this girl, smashing on his bitch, saying, I got two bitches, call them something, baby. You know? The, mm-hmm. the typical future delivery. Bro, I'm not lie, but, like, girl, you know you like a pistol, you would throw away such a toxic ass lyric. My God. For real. But then, like, throwaway hits his beat switch. It's just like, now you're just like emotional. Like, like throwaway literally left all three of us speechless, by the way. We first heard it. Mm-hmm. That, like, that, that left real nigga speechless. Oh, and um, my fourth favorite song, My Savages. Come on. Come on. My Savages is fucking amazing. Number four. Uh, no, yeah, no, no. Number four is um, my savages. Number five, probably Wesley Presley with Metro. That that, that track is mm. good. My sixth favorite track is Monster. So, yeah, so Monster definitely has some of YouTube's most emotional delivery. It definitely has some of his most, you know. In that delivery, because it was hitting niggas at a heart. Never even listened to it. It was hitting us in the heart, my boy. That shit was crazy. Mm-hmm. But, um, yeah, man. So, that, that is your group of monster. And just give y'all opinions on how I have it. Oh, uh, for the people for last video, uh, I, obviously, for the Travis Scott fans, my apologies to Future One. Because the rule, if you if, if you remember, the rule of the thing was we're comparing their biggest hits and we're comparing, and we're smashing them against each other. So I literally just came up with his biggest hits, like from all kind of years of future, and then I did the same for Travis Scott, and we compared them. Now Travis Scott was gonna win; it was actually going blow for blow for blow. But then we started hearing more future. We're just like, mm. <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah. Like, but low key, that was really fun to do though. That 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 little podcast from last episode. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it was. It was. And that's your longest episode, I think, right? Yeah, that's by far. That's by far the longest episode by far. Honestly, I'm not even ashamed of it. Mm-hmm. Well, that is our longest podcast. On average, we only reached up to an hour. Holy! That was two hours. That was like two hours. That one. I mean, hey, man, it's a whole debate, what do you say? <laughs> but anyways, yeah, anyways. Yeah, but, um, yeah, man, so the next album, um, after we got into the emotional vibes of Future, we all took a break, we all, you know, we're just doing our thing, strong to YouTube, talking about shit, as we usually do, because, you know, the music idiots just be vibing in this bitch. Um, hell, I was even making beats, you know what I mean? But we but we're not gonna talk about that just yet. But I have been just know I have been making beats. I have been coming up with flows on them. So just just wait for that little announcement. You, you, you feel me this year? You gotta wait for that announcement. You gotta wait for that announcement first. We can't do it this episode. <laughs> um Yeah, for sure. Yeah. Damn nigga. You're about to hang your head in shame. You sound depressed as fuck. <laughs> I'm just saying, yeah. I'm- <laughs> Yeah, but you can still, but nigga, nigga, it's a podcast, nigga. You can chime in. I'm saying yeah. I'm listening, yeah. yeah. What's the issue? Yeah. What's the issue? What's the issue here? There's no What's the issue. Man, shut up, I smack your fat ass. Mom, man, that sounds kind of crazy. All right, I'm not going to lie. All right, you got you. All right, all right. 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 I'm sorry. It was, um... Anyways. Anyway. <laughs> they, yep. That's gonna be this year's exact, exact stream. Uh, anyways, um... So, uh, yeah. Uh, so, yeah. I, I said, we have been making beats. We can flows. This is freestyles. Tell them, this year. Don't tell them the full thing, but tell them, this year. What I've been doing. I know. I'm 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 gonna give a surprise. I'm gonna give a surprise for next time. I'm gonna give a surprise. I'm gonna give a little sure. secret. I don't see I don't see right, for sure, yeah. We gotta lock in first before we do that. But um Yeah, um Shit, what was the next subject again? Oh yeah, James. 
So after like, the emotional was, vibes was, of Cody crazy, I decided, you know what? Let's really vibe out. Let's do something that isn't really rap like that. And, and we, we listened to James, James Blake's, Blake's album, probably his most popular, popular album, album Assume, Assume One. one. Uh, uh, now, now, now here, here. Give, give your give, give your opinion on James Blake as an artist and give your opinion on Assume One, one as an album. Uh, him as an artist. All right, first up, you know he has jewels. I'm the I am one of, not one of. I'm like a pretty like, I like music a lot. I like his features, and Jules hates it because that one like Tobias song like Where would you go now? Yeah, I think people notice. I don't know James Blake. Blake. We we just just keep, keep, yo, yo, no, 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 no. no, no, no. For people listening, listening at home, this, this motherfucker spam spam my stream, stream with, with that same damn lyrics. <laughs> I, I wanted to be his ass. It just kept going, going, going. No, no, but yeah, sorry. But yeah, James Blake, I like him as an artist. He's he, he's really good. So Jules like, hey, listen to his album, Assume Form. Like, sure, let's do it. And honestly, album was album was actually really good. I I, I had though it low key, I'll be honest with you, I had low like expectation for this album. I'm like, alright, let me I'm gonna listen to this, why not? But most most songs on here, they were kind of a hit. Yeah, they like they're actually pretty, pretty good. Yeah. yeah. I like his album. I'll give it a nine out of ten. Nine in this album. Yeah. Okay. Favorite nine. My favorite song on this album. Come on, baby. It's been, it has to be my Ohio Drive and Metro. It, 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 it has to be. All right. So my second best song I like. I actually like his last song, Lullaby for my uh, Insomniac. I doubt the second one. Favorite. My second second favorite. My third best song I like is Where's the Catch with Andre 2000. That, um, mm. that song was really good. Yeah. My fourth, my fourth best song I like is um Tell Him with um Moses and um Metro. Yeah. The Tell Him that's good. My fifth best song is actually the, the first song, Assume Form. Really, the name of it, the album is my, one of my top five. And my last best song is definitely um Into the Red. Mm. <laughs> Oh, so, yeah. Wait, 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 Blake. Should we have someone else dance into our own love? Like, oh, yeah. So, Jules, Jules <laughs> he, was, he also streamed the album for us. We listened to it. So, Jules was messing around this room. Like, he's on top of his chair, messing around. And he, he accidentally fell off the chair and hurt his foot. And, yo, me and Kissimmee on the call, like, when we saw it, we were dying laughing, bro. For, like, good, like, 10 minutes. Oh, it was so funny. <laughs> <laughs> and it's the last one. I'm pretty sure one of my parents came in. Are you good? Are you good? And I was, I, I, I just saw his foe. That's why I died. We, yeah, yeah, I was wheezing so hard. I was wheezing so fast. That was the most I've ever heard the nigga wheeze in so long. It was, it was so hard. Oh yeah, we try rappers. Oh yeah, that's true. Okay, but, um, but yeah, but, yeah um, just, just for just, just that, that memory, memory um, are you already, already loved love the, the worst, worst fucking song in the song? song. <laughs> the worst song on the album? Are you are wait, you the worst? No, 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 no. Are you love is the worst song? No, 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 no. no. It wasn't was already love. It was can't believe the way we flow. flow. That's, that's the song. The, song. Song. <laughs> oh, the flow. Thank you. Yeah, it was that song. All right. I thought it was the other one. I thought it was the other one. It depends on James Blake. Your song made me feel like a chair. Fuck you. <laughs> he may make music though. For sure. For sure. But fuck, fuck you. you. <laughs> but, uh, yeah. yeah. Um, wait, that's that might be the worst song I've ever heard. But, um, but, yeah, uh, we had, um, I would, I would give this album also a 9, 9 or 8.5. 8. 8. Um, around, around this time, time I, was I was only listening, listening to Mob High. High. Because, because here's the thing, thing about, about me, y'all. I, I can relate, relate to my high kind of heavy. Like, like, especially Travis's verse. Like, like, like Travis, Travis has, has to be really, really liberal. You know what I mean? Because, because like, like, don't, don't be around. Don't, don't be around. You know what I mean? mean? That shit was sitting in there. Yeah. We just need to be mad. And Fantana said this song sucks. Bro. Wait, who said that? And then he said, you know what I got? The ball you with glasses? The oh, uh, oh, oh, yeah, oh, yeah, he, 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 yeah, that guy's kind of stupid. <laughs> <laughs> he, 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 he,
Yeah, he really does. But anyways, we're, we're, we're going back to Chauncey. Chauncey's better. Anyway, anyway. 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 Yeah, yeah, man, and I'll soon more. So, so that is actually, actually one of my more favorite, favorite albums. Uh, from, from like a singer, singer that's, that's not rapping, rapping like, like that. But my favorite, favorite songs, songs, number one, one is My High. High. Number two is actually uh, Where's, Where's the Catch, catch on 100,000. Number, number three, okay. Number, number three, three we have to be assumed assume for the first, first song. song. Number, number four, four Tell Me with Moses Something in Metro. Number, number five is Tira Ray, and number, number six is Bebe Bear with Lamar. Okay. Oh, oh, okay. Oh, okay. Okay. Kiss in intermission. intermission. He's, He's wait, wait, is that a screenshot of me falling out of my chair? chair? You, you bet. Yes, it is. Oh, my God. Yes, I is. <laughs> yes, I is. You, 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 you bet. bet. <laughs> 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 yes, it Yo, Yo, I'm, I'm saving that, that image and not putting it in the thumbnail. thumbnail. He's like, you can't put this I see this is not, not the only one that's been shot. You see? <laughs> I mean, to be honest, I'd be, I'd be, I'd be, I'd be kind of goofy. I'm a goofy nigga. So it's an understandable. understandable. You know you what? what? Just, Just for that, that I'll put it in the thumbnail. You guys can't stop me. me. Yo. He's put that in the thumbnail. Oh my god. Bro, bro it's, it's literally, literally in, the in the corner. corner. You can just, just see, see me in the fucking corner. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's, oh that's, great. that's great. You know, you know what? what? I'm gonna make, make that, that the album cover. cover. <laughs> Stop. <laughs> but yeah, yeah, um... Yeah, yeah bro. bro. But, um, um, assume Form is a pretty, pretty good, good album. album. I, I give, give it an 8.5 or 9. And... I actually, I actually am in a Smith more case, case to check, check out James Blake, Blake. Like, individually. individually. Um, yeah, yeah. And as soon as about, about, that's pretty much all I gotta, I gotta say. say. Wait, wait, is my audio, audio good? Is it audio? It, I, I don't know if it's me, but is it, I think you're echoing again. I think you are. What the fuck? fuck? <laughs> I think you're actually echoing. For real? For real? That, that, like that, like that, that ass? No, no. That, I'm I, I'm not lying I, to you. I, 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 I mean, yeah, yeah. Yes, yes, yeah, 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 yes, Kasune. Okay, okay. Kasune, am I echoing? Oh, I think it's typing. Huh? Levi's typing to say. Am I? I is he echoing? Oh, am I? Am I, am I, am I is he echoing? echoing? No. Oh, so it's no. you. It's you. It's you. <laughs> Get your ass out of here. You know, you know, you know, you know, Okay, okay. All right, all right. All right, all right. You good now? Y'all be okay? okay? Oh, yeah, oh, yeah, much better. It was me. Go ahead, go. All right, all right, right, dope, right dope, 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 Okay, okay. All right, so, I hit my desk so goddamn hard when I was angry. But, yeah, um... So yeah, so, yeah. I mean, that's, I mean, that's, that's, that's about it for a soon form. form. Um, now, now on, on to the, the next, next thing. Uh, a, a new song, song dropped, dropped by, by Don Tolliver. Tolliver. Travis, Travis Scott's, Scott's main, main most consistent artist in Shack. Shack. Uh, it's, uh, it's called Bandit. Bandit. Uh, uh, Kisune. Kisune. I want to hear your reaction to Shack. And Zero Zero is coming in too. So if y'all don't know, Bandit is a main single. For a Don Tolliver's album, album Hearthstone. Hearthstone. I'm not, I'm not gonna, gonna lie. lie. Bandit, Bandit is amazing. amazing. Definitely, definitely, that's definitely, definitely one of the best, best songs in 2024. 2024. But yeah, yeah. Um, um, this is your stream. stream. And then we can, uh, uh, I, I already did. Okay. I'm already in the stream. <laughs> Let's see what they Alright, alright. Here, Here we go. Let's start, Let's start, start this show. show. Uh, I'll. I'll I'll sing, I'll sing along, along a, little a little bit, bit but, but... Oh, oh and by the way, YouTube, YouTube remember, um, um, this is under, under fair, fair use. Kitsune is reacting react to the song. To the song. Um, um, this, 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 this song does not belong to me, it belongs to Don Tolliver. 
There you go. go. Bandit by Don 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 that, that is the end, end of the of song. song. I'm going to run that back. back. <laughs> <laughs> Look like I'm in place. Walk in the strip, she gon' make it bad. I do damage, and they can't stand it. Psycho baby, like it's Marilyn Manson. Better cash advancing. Get this right in the it. Pull the walk out the pantry. Take a sip and I'm dancing. She bout play like a plan B. Oh, she lit like a candle. Boot it up in the car seat. Hold a nigga for ransom. Wanna back better call me. It's whatever I'm geek. Buy the punch at the party. You niggas ain't fly. This shit looking dummy. I'll probably get fried. I look like a mummy. I'm getting this cash. It's Monday to Sunday. I guess you won't talk if it ain't about the money. My boys in the trap and they jump like a bunny. Got pounds and pills. It ain't nothing funny. Up up on the side and I keep the bitch coming. If I gotta reach up, I'ma keep that bitch dumb. Where I slide in that cool boy, I keep that bitch hung. We done went right there, bitch, all the way to the sun. Get deep in the p. Beep, beep. Oh, oh. What the fuck? Fuck. My bad, my bad. To the sun, get deep in the pot, get deep like a plumber. Why would I keep her? I never went love her. Where, 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 give, 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 give like, like a plumber. plumber. You said? Did he take the home? Okay, okay, okay. I'm Did he say give, 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 give like, like a plumber? plumber? I think he just did, yes. <laughs> My brother on his Mario. Mario. He's on his Mario, Mario, Mario shit. shit. He's just digging, digging down, bitches. bitches. Bobby, Bobby, I just went for the end game to my brother. Eat a for dinner, oh, eat a for supper. Why would you keep a little nigga you sober? Why would you keep a little nigga you sober? Oh, ride the highway, ride the bus. Walk my house, look like I'm in place. Walk in the strip, she gon' make it bust. I do damage, and they can't stand it. Oh shit, oh, shit. that was modern, modern slavery. slavery. Wait, 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 no, no, I meant the I Travis Scott song. song. I didn't mean the <laughs> actual modern, modern slavery, slavery too. too. All right, all right. Uh, you know, really, Jewel, I'm black history month the first day, but you're about to come about that, bro. Come on, man. I'm so oh, sorry. Right. No, 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 no. Anyways, you two, we apologize. He, he, he's not racist, this kind. He's not racist, I promise you. For real, For real I'm a nigga. nigga. Anyways, it's your name. How you feel about, about that track? track? Bro, 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 I thought about that song, song, song too, Junior. Ah. Hey. But yeah, yeah. Uh, <laughs> would you say Sam one, one of the best dance on track tracks you've heard? No, I know. I like Bunch of them. I'll take that as a yes, though. Yeah, so that was Bandit by Dodge Um, Give your review on it, though, that's easier. What do you mean? It's a good song. What do you mean? I know. I know. I know. Like, I know, I know, but like, like, tell us about, about or, or you know, you know well, that, well, that, that was like, like, this, this, this song, 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 and you know, his, his, and the back, 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 Anyways, not Oliver. You know, he's a good artist. He's cool. You know, he's really good. Um, this one, Bank a single. It's pretty good. You know, in fact, the one was definitely his best song, twenty twenty four so far. Um, yeah, I'm excited for this Hard Rock, um, album coming up soon. I I'm really excited. Yeah, I'm just kind of hyped for it, but that's all for it. Downtown's always on the radio, bro. 
like if people say he's, he's like Trav, like like Trav's like brother, which I can see it because he's on the same almost. But no, Don's have his own artist, his own thing, his own work, and uh, I'm, I'm excited for this album. And and I'm, I'm actually hyped. I'm actually I actually like the song, the bandit. Like yeah, come yeah. on, you got you got. Yeah, same Eplo like sampling you. That's crazy. That's crazy enough already. Yeah, yeah, Tampa, Tampa, yeah, yeah. Psycho, Psycho baby. baby. <laughs> but yeah, it's a it's a good single. I like it for sure. For sure. Um, and, and yeah, yeah. Uh, I, think I think we're almost, we're almost pretty, pretty much, much just done, done here. here. And, you, know, you know, that's, that's been, been the podcast, podcast I believe. Yeah, yeah, fifty, 50 minutes. minutes. Not that. Okay, okay. but, but yeah, before, before we, go, we go, I just gotta, I gotta say. say this podcast, this podcast has been, been amazing. amazing. And we, we have officially, officially reached, reached 10, 10 fucking days. days. Clap, clap, clap it up for us, real quick. Clap, clap, clap it up for us, real quick. It's 10 days, bro. No, 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 no one thought we would ever do it. And they, they, no one ever thought we would do it. They've been, they've been doing, doing this podcast for 10 days. days. And like I said, I, 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 love I love you guys, guys so much, much for not for only joining, joining this podcast. podcast. You know, you know, and, and being the main, main members, members, but like, like I fuck, I fuck with y'all heavy, heavy, you know? You know? Thank, Thank y'all for actually, actually making, making the podcast, the podcast be, 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 be true. true. Oh, yeah, of course, man. Anytime. You, you, you know me, because we got you, dog. For sure. For sure. And, all, and also, and also shout, 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 shout out to Smiley, 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 Smiley Smiles, Smiles for, uh, for, for teaching me how to be OBS. Oh, yeah. Smiley, Smiley, Smiley. You are a good friend, too. If it wasn't for him, these thumbnails wouldn't yeah, literally. So, smiley, shout out to you, bro. Appreciate it. Yeah, and yeah, yeah. And, and you know, shout out obviously to your sister, and, and, and you know, you know give another platform to talk about their opinions and music. And I can't, I can't, like I said, I can't, I can't believe we actually reached ten days, 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 but, but unfortunately, unfortunately, all good things, things must come to an end for a while. Unfortunately, after this episode, since it's now the final episode, but don't worry. There, there is going to be a season, season two of this podcast. podcast. Do, do not, not worry, worry about it. The podcast, the podcast is not getting canceled. But, but we are going to be going, going on hiatus, hiatus for, for a week. week. We're going to be, be gone. And so just, so just enjoy, enjoy this podcast. podcast run, up run up the views. views you, know you know what I mean? mean? And, and, and yeah, yeah, but we'll, we'll be back with season two. No worries. When Vultures comes out, expect this to return. And give our first reaction. Review. Review. And, and, you know, you we're going to be back, back in business. And I'm going to speak to you guys, guys right, right now. Season, season two will be the season where we talk, talk about just, just more than music. music. We're talking, we're talking about, about shows. shows. We're talking about, about video, video games. games. We're going to talk, talk about movies. You feel, you feel me? me? We're going to talk, talk about, about the media. media. You know? You know? And, and to, to, the hate, hate, to the haters, to the haters <laughs> I guess you finally got what you wanted, right? Season two. Season two. Is, is we're going to be full steam ahead. ahead. Full, full steam, steam ahead. ahead. Other, other medias, medias, other, other shit. shit. We're, we're, hell, we're going to make a Jack Horseman video. video. <laughs> I'm hyped for that. Yes, we're going to make it. Yes, it, it, it's a little, a little behind the scenes thing. But yeah, we're definitely going to do a like, horse video. Oh, so, yeah, so, I'm actually so, hyped for this. Yeah, yeah. yeah. and it's going to bring some special guests that has been episode. And he's going to Expect that. So yeah, so we're yeah, talking about kind of different media, media. and I'm gonna reveal, I'm gonna reveal this, too. this too. Um, I don't know I don't when I'm gonna start. You know what? what? I'm, gonna, I'm, gonna, I'm, gonna I'm gonna start, start a, solo a solo podcast. It's separate, it's separate music, music idiots, idiots. But, but I'm gonna start, I'm gonna start a, solo a solo podcast. podcast. And it's just gonna, it's gonna be just us. I mean, I mean, who knows? I'll probably make the podcast live, and people ask questions about stuff. But it's actually called Jules. I actually, I actually don't, don't have a name, have a name for the podcast, podcast yet, but I think I'm going with um, Catching catch Up with Jules as, a, as, a, as, a, as, a as the name. And, and you, know, you know, and, and honestly, I'm just, I'm just ready, ready to get, get that podcast out. out and it's just going to be me giving y'all updates on how I'm doing. You know what I mean? If I ever go on a hiatus or ever just go missing completely off the YouTube, you know, you guys have that podcast to just catch up. You know what I mean? And, you know, and... Who knows? Who knows? I'll probably, I'll probably give some advice, advice, you know what I mean? mean? If anything, y'all, y'all, y'all can, like, y'all can just fill up the comments, the comments like, questions. questions, you know what I mean? Mm-hmm. And, and y'all can just, like, like, like ask for advice, advice or anything, or anything, you know, saying, saying like, how, how you went, how, how, how you, you know, you know just, just all that, you know? And, yeah, yeah.
So, so beware, beware for that. For that. Be, aware, be aware for the, aware for the, for the catch, catching the ghouls, ghouls, and then be and aware, aware for season, season two of Music, of music Idiots. idiots. And, and we, we all, all truly, truly appreciate, appreciate you. And, and before, before we head, we head out, out, and you know, and you know, you'll 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 see us for a little while. Kitsune, play that clap, play that clap game game real quick. You too, Nazir. Give it up, Rob. We appreciate, appreciate y'all having me. Just know, know that. Thank y'all, thank y'all for showing love, love to the podcast. podcast. And, and yeah, yeah, just be aware. Just be aware, just be just aware, aware of, of the solo, the solo podcast, podcast I'm going to do. Right, yeah, get life advice. advice and and I, I, I let y'all, y'all peer, peer into, into my personal life, life a little, a little bit. bit. And, who, oh, oh, oh no, I actually look at story time as well. well. You know, just you know, opening up about stuff that, you know, I've been doing with life experiences. You know what I mean? And just all this other stuff. But um, but, um yeah, yeah, and, and be aware of where music idiots is too. So for now, for now this, has this has been music idiots, and, idiots and this is the end of season one. one. This is the this end is end for now, and, and we're gonna be gone, gone for a little, for a little while, while. But but you'll see, you'll us, see around. us around. Any final um, messages y'all wanna give, give before we leave? Uh, I just wanna say first and foremost that I am I'm so excited for season two of Music Idiots. It's gonna be full steam ahead. All new stuff going on. I am truly excited. And I want to say thank you guys for tuning in every single day with, with the comments, criticism, and everything. I'm so, I'm so, we're all appreciative of you guys. Y'all make, y'all make, y'all make us motivate to do more of these podcast episodes. For that, I am truly grateful. Jules is definitely grateful. Kasune, he's grateful. We just want to say that we'll be gone, but season two podcast, it's going to be one hell of a show. I'm going to it right now. And, and um, tell my podcast. Um, I was, I was speaking for Jules, you know, he him expressing like his life, what he's going through, some advice for y'all questions. Like, I think that's really good for him doing that by like, his, his solo career, like podcasting. So I think I'm, you know me, I'm gonna support him everything he does. He's, he's my friend, and I love him for real. Hey, hey, man. Hey, hey, no, 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 and Kasuni too as well. We're all gonna ask some questions, but it's gonna be a good time for him. See you too. Music idiots are gonna be on and rolling. We're gonna have some crazy stuff going on, crazy ideas. It's gonna be insane. Yeah. yeah. But yeah, that's pretty much it for me. Uh, thank you guys so much for watching your podcast every single day. We all appreciate it. For sure. For sure. But, uh, but yeah, yeah. Uh, Kasuni. Uh, anything else you want to say? We're gonna be in the south before we leave for a little while. And that's what's going to say that you got for the music idiots out there. It sounds like For the good. audience. Oh, oh boy. Jeez. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's funny. Yeah, yeah. And, and, and y'all about to hear, hear this little outro thing, thing one, more one more time before, before we go on hiatus. hiatus. Remember, remember, we're going to be gone. Be gone but, but we're definitely going to see us around. around. And, and this has this been, been the Gideon's Gideon Podcast. Podcast. Thank, Thank y'all for joining in on our journey. And, and one more thing to say. say. One last, one last time, time. Before we, before go. we go. Nothing, wench. She a kazing.